We have in the audience another celebrity of your role, I'll tell it to you very briefly. You all remember our, you know, the great kick America got when they heard that an American girl had swum, swum the English Channel. And I think the reason we got a kick out of it, there was no publicity about it. I'm going to call her up on stage. You can stay out there. I'm going to call her up on stage so everybody all over the theater can see her. Without any fanfare, she plunged into the channel and made it. Florence Chadwick, where are you seated out there? Now let's have a New York Why, Joe, you come from San Diego, California, don't you? That's right, San Diego, California. You were an amateur swimmer out there before you... Well, no, I turned professional in 1945. Uh-huh. How did you feel it? There was a channel... Uh, we crossed it just before you crossed it, but we were on a ship. Well, I didn't say it. <laughs> and it was very, very rough. The big it was quite, quite rough and uh, pretty cold. What, uh, they said that right at the finish there, when you're about a half a mile out, you changed your stroke, and went into a racing stroke and got ashore, was that it? Well, I picked up my pace a little bit, but I'll admit I was tired, and I don't think it was uh, much faster than the start. It was about the same pace all the way through. Now, why do you put all that grease? Is that the, the grease you put on? Is that to hold off the cold? Or That's right. That's to protect you from the cold water. I wore about uh, six pounds of grease. Uh-huh. And how, how, much weight did you, how much weight did you lose of your own weight swimming the channel, or do you? Yes, I lost about five pounds during the crossing. And, uh, incidentally, I'd like to recommend swimming the channel to these women who'd like to lose weight. Well, I guarantee you, we'll take it off you. Now, there is the best beauty hint I've heard on this show in a long, long time. <laughs> Eddie R. Carroll was on the stage one night, and he suggested that they put on the big, heavy, rubber costume of a jockey when he's uh, trying to take off weight. Florence, congratulations on a... Uh, what, what are you going to do now? Well, I'll tell you, Mr. Sullivan, I'd like very much to uh, crusade on sports. I'm very much interested in sports myself. If there's anything that I can do to encourage uh, sports, well, I'd like to do it. Was that particularly uh, in the groove of youngsters? Or? That's right, to, to the youth uh, throughout the country. I'd like to point out the advantages, both from the mental and healthful standpoint. Mm -hmm. Well, you are certainly the shining example of it. How about a, a very big New York can for a very... <laughs> 